Dan and I are both PhD students in Near Eastern Studies at Harvard, but we actually hadn't met until we were both invited to the same dinner party at this place called Beehive in Boston. I remember that night really vividly because it was a really stressful day, uh, and I wasn't sure whether I was going to go to this party or not, but I did. And I remember sitting, uh, sitting and waiting for the party to sort of get started, and through the door comes this like it's like a beam of light. It's like this incredibly beautiful woman just walked into my life. Um, so we were seated next to each other and struck up a conversation, which was really fun, and we had a lot to talk about. We decided we wanted to hang out again. And I thought the most convenient thing to do would be for me to hand him my business card. So that's what I did, and I guess that was... But I wasn't really sure what that meant. It seemed to me kind of like an ambiguous thing. I was like, is she giving me her phone number, or is she like, want to sort of academically collaborate in the future? So I guess Dan thought that the safest thing to do would be to add me on Facebook, uh, which he did. And we messaged back and forth a couple of times and then decided to have dinner at this Italian restaurant. Yeah, it turns out that Sadaf and I ended up having a whole lot in common, uh, in addition to obviously both liking Indian movies. Uh, we're both from the Midwest, uh, Sadaf is from Chicago and I'm from Kentucky, so we grew up watching sort of the same children's programs. We, we reminisce a lot about the Bozo the Clown show. Uh, we like the same kind of music. We like, you know, hip-hop and reggaeton and Indian and Iranian music. Uh, we both enjoy Persian literature and just so many other little things that it just you know, seemed like we really, really clicked. Um, and it's really actually very sweet because the day after that dinner, I woke up to this email from Dan that started with the words, good morning, beautiful. And I just thought it was really cute and was just a sign of how expressive he is. And I think that that's actually kind of unique, so I'm really happy that he has that quality. I love so many little things about Sadaf. She always lets me know how she's feeling, and even when she doesn't, it's like totally obvious. Uh, I especially love the sound of her laugh. It's totally distinctive. You can hear it from miles and miles away. Uh, in fact, my, my dad you know, used to tell me that uh, her laugh sounds like silver bells, and even though we didn't really know what that meant, it was kind of cute. Um. Yeah, so actually we're both really close to our parents and um, very early on within a month of meeting each other, I had met his parents and he had met my parents and we all get along really well and they're really important to us. Sadaf and I knew that we had something really special going right from the beginning and within even a month of dating, we had both admitted to each other that we did a Google search for how do you know if you had found the one. But I think it turns out that we actually both knew the answer to that question. And now we're getting married, so... Yeah, yeah. we're getting married. So, I'm Sadaf. And I'm Dan. And we're, we're getting, getting married. married.